So today I'm changing oil on my 1947 Ford 8N. I'm going to start using it to grade around the house a little bit, messing around with it. So I figure let me change the oil. It's been a couple years. I took off the, the drain plug is down here and it comes out super fast. So you kind of want to drain it into maybe a five gallon bucket or a real big pan. I just let the drain plug pan. I just let the drain plug fall in here and I'll get it out at a later time. This is the oil filter housing. So you just take this nut off here. I don't have another oil filter, but it's, I probably have five hours on this thing since I did it last. So it's, uh, I'm sure it's fine. I just want to check it. How long is this bolt? Goodness. Finally. Oh, that hurt. And that's the oil filter. You can get all the parts for these at Tractor Supply. Usually has them on the shelf, or well, they used to anymore. But yeah, it's good. It's fine. Nice and clean. So we'll leave that in there. Pop that guy back on. The older it is, the better and easier it is to work on. I'll tell you right now. You can work on this whole thing basically with this one croissant wrench. I'm stuck it up. What's that? Just letting the oil drain all the way out. This is the oil fill that has this cool little air. It's just the breather and the fill in one, which is pretty cool. Of course, like every project, battery's dead, so. It's the old gasket. Amazon. New gasket. I'm sure it'll leak. croissant wrench if I said you could work on this whole tractor with just this wrench I bet you I do like to put a little RTV around it but I don't have any so that'll do if it leaks we'll just drain the oil back out another day put it right back in but that's it that's the drain plug Right there. Now we'll fill it up. This is just 30 weight, better than what they would have in 1947 anyway.
charger, but we'll give it a shot. Absolutely nothing. Try again. No. All right. Well, Yeah, the battery is dead. Let's put the battery up. Oh, battery failure. Okay. Let's just do this from right here. Out of gear so we don't get ran over. Bolts are kind of rusty, so we'll give it a quick loosen and tighten. Maybe clean it up a little. Could, this could be bad also though. It's been sitting outside, so like I said, I should have had it under the lean to down by the barn down there. I don't have one on my barn yet, but we have one on the barn down by the start of the farm and uh, we'll see. I mean, I doubt that did anything, but let's see. Longer than a year. And I know the generator works, so 